escape from their captor early this morning were taken for further... Actually, it looks like she's doing just fine. Looks like she's right where she wants to be. Miss Keener, one of your colleagues from Ameritips is asking for you. She's in the waiting area. Right this way. Thank you. I'm sorry. I know I'm not supposed to be here. I'm supposed to be a secret, but I have to talk to you about something. Everything that I've been seeing in my dreams the last few nights, everything about Susie, it happened. It did not happen. Not to my daughter, not nine years ago. We know that now. What you saw was happening to Melanie Linder. You got the faces confused. You put Susie's face where Melanie's was. No, and I think I got the faces right. Susie's, Joanna Wheeler's, the kidnappers. That makes no sense. Joanna Wheeler was just freed. Obviously, she wasn't locked up in the basement with my daughter nine years ago. I think she was. What are you saying? She was in on it. She and her boyfriend. He's not the man who took Susie. But I believe he and Joanna have the same arrangement. What do you mean? They would target a girl, someone they both wanted. And the boyfriend would kidnap her and throw her in the basement with Joanna, who would pretend to be a fellow victim. Well, why would she do that? Because she's a sociopath. Because she thinks it's fun. Because it's all a big game to her. She likes befriending them, getting them to open up, seducing them, keeping them close to her, and then watching. They're surprised when she betrays them, laughing while they're suffering. I saw Joanna when they brought her in. She didn't look like she was playing a game to me. She's acting for you, for the police, for the media. She has to. The last thing she imagined was that Melanie Linder would get that gun away from her.